Hello everyone. As dealerships in China close, buyers are turning to reliable alternatives. Mio stands out with its direct sales model and dependable quality. Imagine the frustration of spending over 1.5 million RMB or roughly 200k dollars on a Land Rover, only to find out you can't even drive it because the dealership that sold it to you is going out of business. This unfortunate scenario is exactly what many customers are facing in China right now. There's a worrying trend taking shape across the country traditional automotive dealerships, particularly those selling luxury brands, are shutting down, leaving buyers in a precarious situation. This shift is funneling business towards stronger players in the market, like Neo, as customers grow wary of risking their money on a car they might not even receive. Imagine the position of someone considering buying a Land Rover then hearing about how someone else couldn't drive their new vehicle because the dealership collapsed. Naturally, this leads buyers to more reliable and stable companies like NEO. So what's driving this shift in the market? Another major dealership group in China has gone under, following in the footsteps of Grand Auto. This new closure impacts major luxury brands like Land Rover, Rolls-Royce, Aston Martin, Porsche, Benz, Jaguar, Audi, Lincoln, and even more mainstream names like Toyota. As these dealerships close their doors, consumers are losing trust in the traditional dealership model, especially because, in some cases, buyers never even receive the cars they've paid for. Instead, these cars are confiscated and auctioned off to settle the dealership's outstanding debts. The result? More and more consumers are choosing to go with direct-to-consumer brands like Neo, which offers stability and security in these uncertain times. It's not just dealerships that are feeling the pinch. Some of the bigger automotive players in China are struggling too, largely due to Neo growing success. Take SAIC, for example, one of the largest automotive companies in China. They recently announced a 40% reduction in staff in certain regions because their sales numbers are plummeting. In July alone, they delivered just over 14k vehicles nearly 6k fewer than NEO. That's a striking comparison, considering the size and reputation of SAAIC in the Chinese auto industry. This is a clear sign of NEO rising dominance in the market, and it's a trend that seems poised to continue. As more companies struggle and exit the market, consumers are left with fewer choices. This naturally pushes them towards successful, stable brands like NEO. When people see that NEO is selling a significant number of cars, they're more inclined to buy from them, especially when compared to brands that are barely moving any inventory. A thriving company inspires confidence among buyers. Interestingly, many NEO customers have reported longer than expected wait times for their cars. This delay isn't due to production issues but rather high demand. While it can be frustrating for buyers to wait a little longer for their new vehicle, it also signals that NEO is in a very healthy position, with plenty of customer interest driving its sales. Waiting a few extra days for a car isn't a bad trade-off if it means you're buying from a company that's in demand and delivering a quality product. In contrast, the story isn't as rosy for some other brands. A recent case involving another electric vehicle EV in China highlights just how critical battery technology is becoming. One car owner had only driven their EV for about a year when a problem arose a battery error that rendered the vehicle undrivable. Upon investigation, it was discovered that a rat had chewed through the ABS plastic casing of the battery. The car warranty didn't cover this type of damage, and neither did the insurance company. As a result, the owner was left with a hefty bill of 80k RMB around 11k dollars to replace the battery. The dilemma? Pay the bill or have a car that's completely useless. This incident underscores the importance of having a high-quality product. Buyers are becoming more discerning, especially when it comes to the reliability and durability of EV batteries. Brands that cut corners and deliver subpar products will inevitably lose out, as this type of negative experience spreads quickly through word of mouth or social media. In contrast, Neo battery packs feature metal enclosures, providing a higher level of protection and reducing the risk of this kind of issue. 
No one wants to buy a car that might have a serious battery problem down the line particularly when something as simple as a rat could cause thousands of dollars in damage. Looking ahead, the situation is likely to become even more challenging for automakers with lower quality batteries. Starting next year, new battery inspections will be implemented across China. These inspections are designed to identify any batteries that aren't safe for the road, including those that pose a fire risk. When a battery doesn't pass inspection, it will need to be replaced, no questions asked. This could lead to enormous costs for consumers who have purchased vehicles with poor quality battery systems. For many, the hassle and expense will simply be too much prompting them to opt for a brand like Neo instead. So, we're seeing a perfect storm in the Chinese auto market. Dealerships are collapsing, leaving consumers with fewer choices. At the same time, new regulations around battery safety are set to push even more buyers toward Neo, a brand that has consistently demonstrated its commitment to quality. The direct sales model is also becoming increasingly attractive as consumers shy away from traditional dealerships that might not be around to support them in the long run. In fact, there have been countless stories of buyers who've lost their cars after the dealerships they purchased from went bankrupt. The vehicles are confiscated by the banks, leaving customers empty-handed. It's a devastating outcome, and one that's making buyers think twice before going the dealership route. The Neo Direct Sales model, on the other hand, eliminates this risk entirely, offering peace of mind for buyers who know they're getting the same price and service no matter where they are. Looking to the future, NIO is in a prime position to become the go-to choice for EVs in China. As competitors struggle or exit the market entirely, NIO combination of innovative technology, reliable products, and a direct sales model is paving the way for continued growth. Battery swapping technology, which allows NEO customers to quickly swap out depleted batteries for fully charged ones, is another factor that sets the company apart. As battery inspections become more stringent, the ability to easily swap batteries will be a huge advantage for NEO customers. Ultimately, NEO success is built on a foundation of quality, reliability, and customer trust all of which are becoming more and more important in the Chinese automotive market. As competitors continue to falter, NEO is well positioned to capture even more market share in the years to come, solidifying its status as a leader in the EV space. Thank you for joining us today. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more stock predictions and market insights. Remember to turn on the notification bell so you never miss an update. Happy investing, and see you in the next.